I am going to work for different styles of filling techniques. Most of uh, designs that I am going to create is uh, using reverse negative space technique. Okay, so let us start one by one. This, uh, this are, this all the designs are for the bridal design. So in the in the blocks format, I am going to create this in the blocks format so that you can also practice for this kind of parallel lines okay now first draw blocks this is the best way to do practice before applying bridal design now next create some more blocks keep equal distance between each of this standing line now again create horizontal line once again keep equal distance okay now checks pattern I have finished now the next step is applying pattern so to apply pattern again I need to create diagonal lines so just draw diagonal lines as I am drawing you have to pass this diagonal lines from this center let me show you again okay. now this is my first block And this one is my second block this is my third block now this one is my fourth block which consists four squares now I am creating diagonal lines again in this block which consists this four squares one two three and four So here I have finished the basic drawing for making this pattern. Okay, let me show you here uh, how we need to fill this. So just consider this box group of 1, 2, 3 and 4 blocks. So first you need to create 2 diagonal lines. Okay, how? we are going to fill is first fill this completely now just skip this and over here again fill this skip this one this section fill this skip this one and fill this section now below this box just assume below this box we are going to fill in reverse manner as we have filled this so we will skip this and fill this one skip this fill this one skip this fill this one and okay so alternatively you need to complete this kind of filling checks pattern okay now let us start in this one as I told you one block that means combination or a group of four squares okay so this one is my first block second third fourth fifth sixth okay now one by one I am going to start filling this box
okay so first block i have completed now in the next block this is the second block so i need to skip this one and i need to start filling this in this way skip this one fill this skip this one and fill this one okay now the next third block is the group of this four squares so now as this one is a empty portion so here i need to fill this skip this one fill this skip this one fill this skip this one and fill this similarly now as this one is a empty portion and this one is a filled one so here we can fill this skip this one fill this skip this one fill this skip this one and fill this particular portion now just check continuously now we will work for the fifth block as this one is a empty so here we will start our work this one is empty so we have started our work from this block now skip this one fill this skip this one fill this again skip this and fill this portion okay now in the next block there are two ways to start your work this one is empty and this one is also empty so either you can start over here fill this skip this one fill this from here also you can start your work just skip this fill this okay so in this way you can fill this entire space using this first technique this you can uh, apply for on hand section like this just draw number of parallel lines and just work the similar things over here so this is also part of bridal design or the same checks pattern also you can apply on finger also okay now next let us see the next pattern okay for uh, next pattern is based on leaves pattern so once again i will start my work with the uh, making block so just draw four parallel lines keeping same distance between each of these two consecutive lines now after doing this next draw horizontal line again keep the same distance between each of this horizontal line okay now in this box i am going to create pattern let me show you over here okay so just consider this box now i am going to create this kind of leaf pattern so what you need to work is diagonally just join these two points like this then the second curve joining these two points like this and in the rest entire section we will fill this 
okay so this is the basic shape so here we need to create even number of even number of horizontal space one two three and four why because each pattern requires two horizontal rows so that's why whenever you are creating this design just make sure that you have created even number two four six eight this all are the even numbers so make sure that you have created in a multiple of two rows one two three four or you can also make six rows if you need practice more okay because we need two rows to create this entire design okay now step by step we will start creating this pattern first this is the first one second third fourth this one is a fifth block sixth one and this one is the last one just create the petals as i am creating right now okay now rest space i need to fill this so that's why we can also say this is the part of negative space techniques at the end just put dot in the center of each flower okay so this one is a second pattern now let us focus on third pattern okay now third pattern is little bit different than the first two patterns in this again you need to create even number of horizontal lines as we have worked over here even even number of horizontal lines so let us start okay this one is a first second third and fourth so four parallel lines or four even number of horizontal rows i have created over here okay now next you need to create vertical rows so just you need to keep equal distance between each of this vertical rows okay now just concentrate here now next is you need to join in this way okay 
then again apply shading and finish this again apply shading inside this triangle and give the border okay now similarly in the mirror image we will create another triangle that will be the mirror effect of this previous triangles now just apply shading and recreate just redraw the border apply shading redraw the border apply shading redraw the border okay now in this space we will create small flower so in each section in each of this section we will create two petals and put dot in the center again in each of section we will create two petals at the end put dot over here here we will create half flower here also we will create half flower now the same thing we are going to fill in this row so first create triangle now apply shading in this triangle and just give the border you can also fill this entire triangle also now draw triangle in this way in mirror effect apply shading redraw it now in this space we will create flower in each section we will create two petals 1 2 1 2 okay so here is at the end put dot in the center part of this flower once again i am showing you creating of this flowers just assume this is a plus sign so first two petals we will create in this section now in the next section again we will create two petals here also we will create two petals and in this also we will create two petals and at the end just put dot